Guys, it's Aoife from Fred Weezy Died Laughing and I'm here with a April book haul. And I actually bought a few books in April. I don't normally buy a lot of books every month, but I bought a few at the start of April and then a few at the end of April. So I have enough that I can do a book haul. So that is pretty exciting. So seeing as the, thir or the fourth and final book of the Raven Boys um, series was out this month, I decided that I might as well go off and buy the trilogy and, um, or not the trilogy, sorry, the series even though I've already read the first three books but they're kind of just something that I decided I wanted to have and then as I bought the first three I was like I might as well go and buy the new one when it comes out so now I have the full set I have the Raven Boys, the Dream Thieves, Blue Lily Lily Blue and the Raven King all by Maggie Steve Otter and these are just so gorgeous especially when you have them all together their spines are just absolutely beautiful. I just love seeing them on my bookshelf um, and I'm really excited. I haven't, I only got The Raven King yesterday and I haven't started reading it yet. I don't know if I'll read it this week or next week maybe when I'm on holidays. Um, we will see but I'm definitely eager to get started with it. And there's like a part of me that wants to read the whole thing all over again, like the whole series. Um, but I don't really have time for that I don't think but we will see. And then at the same time I was getting most of the Raven Boys series I actually went and I bought a really random book which is really unusual for me because normally I know what kind of books I want to buy if, if I've decided I'm going to buy a book but I was just in a bookstore and they kind of had some just kind of some recommendations up at the top of the store and I picked up this one which is The Dollaker by Caroline Bray or got Caroline Barry sorry and um there was just something about this that just really intrigued me it was just it was just a real cover buy I think if you can just see the cover there and I think it was again the little um line up here which says Victorian London has Jack the Ripper Georgian Dublin had the Dollaker and it's something kind of like a murder mystery set within Georgian Dublin and it's something about something is stalking the alleyways of Dublin people are showing up dead there's kind of a rumor that it's like half man half pig kind of creature that is killing people and this guy who's kind of a writer and he wants to try and get behind it and he starts figuring things out and he kind of stumbles across something that he never thought that you know he would find and it was something like more than he could have ever imagined the real story behind whatever is doing these killings and it just sounds really really intriguing so it is a re recent release it was released this year and yeah I'm just really excited to read it I just think it sounds really really good and it's a signed copy as well which um it's cool it came signed so I am happy about that and yeah I can't wait to read it and the next few books are also all part of a series that I decided I wanted to reread and I'm hopefully going to read them this week for the um read your bookshelf um read the tom because these are something I want to read the whole thing and then the whole series again as when I first read them I kind of read them kind of with a, a good like a year or two apart from each book and I just want to read them again where I'm really fresh going into each book and I know the story rather than kind of trying to catch up and see what it's all about again. So I have The Prince of Thorns by Mark Lawrence, The King of Thorns and The Emperor of Thorns and again beautiful covers. I love all of these covers so much and I'm really really excited to reread these because I really do love the series and then I also got the first book of kind of the follow on or companion series which is the Red Queen's War and the first book is Prince of Fools. The next book in this The Liar's Key didn't come out until a couple of weeks after I bought these um, like in this like little paperback edition so I don't have it but I do I did get a copy of Neck Alley a couple of weeks ago and I also got a copy of the next book in the trilogy, the last book called Wheel of Ossheim. Um, so I both I have to read all of these basically and then read those two to review for Neck Alley and I will get them um, when they do come out um, on uh, this kind of paperback as well so they all match and then I can have them all because I know these. this is also going to be a series that I'll reread again because it's really really good. I really love this book and um, again really good high fantasy series um, so I would if anyone is looking for a good high fantasy series to read I would recommend um, The Prince of Fools which is the Broken Empire trilogy um, is what it's called and then this one is the Red Queen's War trilogy so yeah. So that is all the books I got this month um, and I'm not sure if I'll be buying any books next month but I'll definitely be going to the library so there'll be a library haul at some point and thanks for watching. I'll see you guys again next time. Bye!